problem is, is we become so entrenched in opinion, disagreeing with someone becomes an argument rather than a discussion. So, I mean, and of course, how we live now, it's like, well, this is my flag and I am planting it and I am going to stake everything on this argument. You have to listen and you have to ask questions and you have to be curious. And the thing I always try and do is, okay, if I was in their shoes, if I lived in their culture, if I had that same upbringing, if I was raised in this way, how would I feel? So trying as hard as you can to place yourself into what they have had to deal with, I think gives empathy to another person's argument. And instead of coming at it with a point of arrogance, it's a point of humility of, I'm here to learn and tell me, tell me what it is that you feel and ask questions. And then that allows the other person to relax and not feel like they're being attacked. And all of a sudden it's a discussion rather than an argument. It, it goes to working with a team as well, because if you can show vulnerability and a willingness to learn and grow, and and I, I have no problem saying, oh God, I had no idea about that. I, no, tell me about it. I am good at knowing what I don't know. And I do think that helps. I think that helps the group because it's not like, this is the way we do things and I am going to be right at all times and I don't care what you think. Um, so right away, it's a safer place to just speak up, to disagree, tell me if you disagree. I want feedback. I want to get better. I want to grow. Laying that all out on the table, I think is important to any team and culture in terms of setting a place where people feel secure enough where they can actually speak up because then you're a stronger organization.